What's up everyone? Happy Wednesday. Hope your week is going well. Today is August 30th. It's crazy that we are already um, through August. Uh, feels like it just started not too long ago, but then at the same time, feels like it has been the longest, not even two weeks, week and a half um, yet since school started. Um, it'll be all right. It's all going to get better. I keep telling myself that. Um, but yeah, it's been rough. So, uh, we're just kind of taking every day as it comes. Um, but it'll be okay. So, I keep telling myself the routine will come. The kids will get better. It, it'll, it'll all work itself out. So, <laughs> but, uh, it, it'll be all right. So, all right. Today's title is See Things Differently. It says, my thoughts are not your thoughts, nor are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. So, Isaiah 55, verse 8. 53-year-old Eric, I'm going to butcher this, I'm sure, Wayenmare has kayaked the raging whitewater through the Grand Canyon, skied Black Diamond Slopes, and scaled several of the world's tallest mountains, and he is a certified solo skydiver and paraglider. Eric is also blind. Whew. As a boy, he was diagnosed with an extremely rare eye disease and completely lost his vision at 14. He struggled to adjust to his new reality. When he eventually accepted his condition, Eric said, I was able to push the perimeters of what I was capable to do. When he finally accepted his condition. The more we pursue the pursue, the more we pursue uncomfortable situations and experiences, the more we learn to see them as opportunities for growth. We don't always get to choose our adversity but we get to choose how we deal with it. The attitude, the effort, the courage, those are all choices we get to make. I might have to share that with my students today. The more we pursue uncomfortable situations and experiences, the more we learn to see them as opportunities for growth. I love that. I feel like that fits in so well with math because they don't like math. A lot of them. It's an uncomfortable situation, right? It's an uncomfortable thing. The more we pursue that, the more opportunities we have for growth. That goes hand in hand with being in middle school. Middle school is hard for these kids. The more and more that they pursue, right, these uncomfortable situations. Not necessarily get themselves into it on purpose, but when they do get into it, they figure out a way to deal with with it and work through it, the more experience they're going to get to have courage, right? To have um, effort, okay? The attitude, have all those things. The more and more they learn to work through those things, the more and more of that stuff they get. Everyone have a great Wednesday. Have a great week. And of course, go be the example.